But this is Super Mario, Mario Aji, the last two races the Indonesian rider has competed in. He's unfortunately... Red Bull MotoGP Rookies Cup is go once again. And it seems as though everybody cleanly away, but so much went on in a singular corner. We saw it in Moto3, well, in all classes today, but especially in Moto3. With so many people going into Turn 1, it really sucks you in, especially when there's like five, six... First time here today. Yeah, this is where we're going to see a lot of action into turn 12 left-hander. And there it is, Mario Aji up the inside and following him through is Tayo Furisato. So Holgado goes... He's got five victories to his name this year, four in Asia Talent Cup, one in Rookies Cup already. He needs no more introduction. So he's so far this year, just down in seventh place. This is the Ralph Alvin corner, the waterfall, as they plunge down the hill towards turns 12 and 13. Many riders come across it here in the race weekend. He's here, ready to take the fight to just about everybody. There it is, the front quarter. David Munoz leads Danny Holgado, Mario Aji, Tyre for Rosato, and Tatakor Wazri moves in the front. So easy to lose the rear. And there is Mario Aji who will lead them out of the final corner for the first time here at the Saxon Ring. A great opening lap there to be back in the race lead. How about it then? That was awesome from Danny Holgado. Just that's the best way when you get overtaken this price. What is it? No, it's not. And as he plunges down the waterfall, I think we're going to see some more maneuvers coming down. The hill is Holgado going to reset the lead straight away. I think he is. But Waterfall once again. David Alonso looking very strong here today. This might be some of the best. A lot of riders this weekend. Thankfully, uh, Eddie O'Shea is back on his feet. That's the main thing. He's in cocoon. <laughs> it's such good racing in the Red Bull rookies, but I, I didn't think we'd see a lot of moves going into that turn, that left hander because Me neither. <laughs> it's just it's just not an overtaking pace really. But the rookies are making it look like one. Who's that wow. Steven at the inside? How it's about Mario that? Angie. I tell you what, the moves we're seeing here are far more creative than what we saw on the circuit. But no, as David Alonso moves up the inside into third spot at the final corner. Oh, and he really shoves out Mario Angie there onto the green. Thought he'd be a bit of a weight disadvantage as they got to such an elevation change around it. So we've seen a pin across his last time out in Magella, who's strong there as well, just missed out on the podium. And what about Uriarte? He would have yes as well. So the leading group is the leading 14 riders as they come down the wall for one. Scott uh, Offfield back up on his feet and he'll be ready to go again tomorrow, I'm sure. Yeah, good on him. So, get your weeks for the London. But when he finds it back, yes, he will. Straight through once again. Oh, a bit of chapter on the front end there. 